Happy Wednesday morning. Happy Wednesday morning. On our way back, but we had to go to a kid's store first. Duh. Duh. I'll in, we should insert some footage right here. I took a little footage of the store. Oh my gosh, this place is so adorable. They were having a little sale. I actually found them online. It's the cutest kid's store ever. Ever. Oh my gosh, look at this little bike. I love it. So cute. cutest store I've seen in a long time. So we just had such a fun time at this place called, look at their bag, look how cute. I don't know if you can see it because it's so bright out here. Oh, <laughs> Kodo Kodomo, I don't know. Kodomo Boston. It is so cute, go to their website. Um, they also have an Instagram, which we can put all that information on the screen. Yeah. Um, but I met the owner, she was so kind and so nice and sweet to Harper and it was so fun. So I got Harper a couple things that I've been looking at for like ever. And then they had they had a lot of it on sale. So I got some really, I don't feel like I got some really I like good that. deals. I like that. So cute. So now we're headed back to the hotel. Get packed up, get to the train and try it again. I'm actually like, even though it was kind of crazy, I'm ready to sit down for four hours. I'm really tired. Oh yeah. I know daddy's not super tired, but. No, I'm good. I'm, I'm exhausted. That is like a whole <laughs> handful of days. I have been Ooh. so incredibly busy oh, yeah. and oh, yeah. yeah. So, so anyways. Uh, sounds good. I'm sure Olivia will give y'all a haul of what she bought. Oh yeah. We'll haul. get back to those. Yeah. They had like all of my favorite brands there. Like they had like new new new. They had um Whistle and Flute. Whistle and Flute, which ah, I, I remembered one. <laughs> Huck's baby. Um, so many like good ones um, that you just like and the thing that I like I think that it's so important those brands are really expensive they're expensive for a reason because they're not like disposable clothes so it's not like you, I mean you guys know I love to get inexpensive stuff at, like H&M and Zara and blah 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 and I thought it was really interesting that I mean she was like we were talking about that she was just like you know I really believe in good quality clothes and blah 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 and she loved Harper's outfit and I was like uh don't tell her that his shirt from H&M and his pants are from Zara um but I feel like it's it's just like how I like to do my wardrobe. Like I have some really nice pieces that are a little more on the expensive side and then I mix it in with the bulk of my wardrobe is a little bit less expensive because, you know, I'm able to do that, which is, I think is important because I don't, I'm not made of money. <laughs> you know what I mean? I just feel like I, I love going to those kind of kids stores because a lot of those companies were started by women or started by moms. Yeah, moms. And so I feel like, and she's a mom and she, you know, has her store in Boston. And I think it's just so great that we can support her and her business. And, you know, I spent a little bit of money and now I got three pieces that I can add into his wardrobe that will mix in perfectly. I try to get like pieces that are just real interesting. Like if I'm gonna spend that kind of money on, you know, on something like that, that's a little more, boutique -y. I try to buy things that are real different and interesting. Yeah. That'll add a lot of uniqueness to his, his little bolt trunk. Sounds good. All right, let's go get packed up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so this is the place. I love it. It's just, it's got that like, I don't know, the logo is super pretty. Um, and then I got just a couple things for Harper. I got these Hux Baby um, leggings with the little bunnies, which I just think are so cute. They'll be, I got them in size three, so they'll be a little bit big. He'll definitely be able to wear them through the fall, which even though they're white, like I would put with like a black sweater and I, I don't have any, I, I put him in white stuff all the time. But these would definitely be like something he would wear to church or wherever. And then these I've been looking at all summer, these little like, they're just like little shorts that Nunu does, and I got them in the four five. This company is uh, one of my favorites, um, and they did splatter stuff all 
season. So I really like that. So I thought like, I mean, he has a little black tank top. He has like, just to me, he can wear it with a lot of anything. But this is the big one. There's a company called Whistle and Flute. Um, that I just, I love their stuff. And so this is like one of those big jump, uh, romper jumpsuit things that daddy loves mm -hmm. for the fall. One piece, one piece. One just, piece. Just jump in. It's nice and it's, it's thick, but it's not too thick. And it'll be so nice, especially in the fall. And it's got like their little, they, they do all the kawaii, like the kawaii clouds. They do all the kawaii, the bubble tea. They do all the little kawaii stuff. It's got the hood on it. So that was kind of like my splurge per purchase. Um, it was six, this one, this was 64 full price. So I think that's like, you know, I mean, yeah, it's expensive, but it's like something that he'll wear. It's organic cotton. He'll wear this all the way through the spring. Yeah. So. Sounds um, good. Forgive the uh, messy hotel room. We are packing up oh, as we speak. Like it looks like squatters. It looks like squatters living here. But that's when you have a kiddo yep. in a hotel room eating out of it and everything else for three or four days. That's what yeah. you got, right, Harper? <laughs> oh, he's pooping. Oh, he pooping? wow. On that note, so let's pack. about going on choo choo yeah are you excited about it tell them tell everybody oh. track two <laughs> track two hi mom are you ready to go home i'm ready to go home <sighs> made it back honey you made it back oh my goodness hello BB so happy to see you yeah so we made it back that was a marathon right mom yes 
that was uh, pretty miserable. We got into Penn Station and it was a crazy hour, so we're like, we'll take the subway with all our suitcases and him who just fell asleep. Thank goodness he fell Yeah, I may think he just fell asleep. And we should give an update really to the last 25 minutes. He was amazing. So thank you for your prayers. I know that's what helped. The last 25 minutes, he was so tired because he wouldn't go to sleep even though he washed stuff the whole time and things like that. But he um, he did so much better. Wouldn't you say, Mom? He did so good. So good. So then that was just pretty a miserable hour trying to stuff ourselves on two subway trains and haul stuff downstairs. And he's crying. So we're going to end Wednesday. Right, Mom? Yeah. We are going to buy a Powerball ticket though because it's $700 million. Now, wouldn't that be a twist to the so, if the next time you see us, we might be seven hundred million dollars richer. Who knows? If not, we're having a big. If so we're having a big. We are the wards party. Oh my gosh! Who knows? And you're all invited. You're all pay, invited. Pay for all your plane tickets to come. <laughs> we'll just have a meet up somewhere fabulous. And pay yeah, it'll be great. It'll be great. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Should we go right? No, no. Push that. Push straight. Push straight. Remember the construction? Yeah, yeah wait. Gosh. Should we buy our ticket? Not here. Watch this big turd on the floor, guys. <laughs> oh, gosh. Whoa. Whoa, Harper Ellis. And that would be the downside of the yo-yo stroller. Yo-yo stroller on a cobblestone. Uh, yeah, brick sidewalk. But anyways. <laughs>